This is a quick guide to setting up TextPad to compile C++ programs. And just a reminder that the compiler for Windows should be downloaded on your C drive. And it's the MinGW32 uh, uh, folder. And within the bin folder there, we have been using GCC and we're now just going to be using G++ to compile C. So that's where we're going to navigate to from within TextPad. So, so to set up a tool to enable us to do that, we're just going to go to Configure Preferences and just click on Tools. And so I haven't clicked on the plus sign, I've just clicked on the word Tools and we're going to add a program. And the program we're going to add is navigate to where our compiler is. So in the bin directory, there's g++.exe, and then just click open. And now we can apply this, and we should now be able to expand tools here and see g++ written underneath the other tools. Uh, so here is the program that we've just navigated to. The parameters we're going to, the easiest way is just, just pick them up from our C program and delete the ones we don't need. So let's just do a control C, go back to here and do a control V. And the ones that we don't need is we don't need the standard to be C99. That only applies to C programs. And we let's take off the minus where um, parameter two. So we're just left with minus wall, minus capital O, minus small o, and then just the base name .exe and uh, the file. So that's all we need in there. We can apply this. And we can also now click on tools and just do a slow double click to rename this so always a little bit tricky and you can give this a more meaningful name such as uh, compile c++ program and then um, Okay, that. So we should now be able to also add a new tool. Uh, tool three, mine will be, um, I think. Oh, although it hasn't added it here, so I think I need to restart TextPad. But I'll just do that in one um, go. The other thing we need to do again under preferences is just change the file um, extension just because it's easier. So instead of having C as our file extension, if we have CPP and apply that, and I'm just going to go back to tools and just make sure that this program here is all set. And let's just okay this. So I'm just going to close um, down. So this is my compile C program. Run C program stays exactly the same, but it might be more meaningful again under preferences rather than just having it as run C program uh, to rename that as just run program because the parameters for run the C program it is we are just going to be calling command.exe and then running the name of the file that we're working on and so just apply that and OK. Oh, and actually it was just the apply that I was missing and I've got a compile C program here. So let's just do a, a quick check to make sure it works. So I'm just going to type in a, a quick test file here to make sure it works. So let's uh, put our hash include in and an IO stream file is all we need. And then using namespace std and then int main and then just um, 
compile this and we'll just have it as a test program um, and it compiles successfully and we can just run it by clicking our, our normal run button whoops I need to be clicked in the file before any uh, and there we go and uh, and that's just setting up textpad <laughs>